So like I said, I gotta get this off, put the material back, and then, um, yeah, then I should be able to unbolt the tail lights, pull them out. But like I said, I got to get some bulbs so I can test the bulbs out and make sure everything worked. I'm going to have to put some bricks behind and in front of the wheel so the car won't move while I'm trying to test it out. The new smoked out tail lights for the charger. So this is the passenger side and this is it. You feel me? LED board here. I got to put the, like I said, the reverse light in. And yeah, this is what they look like. And I think it's going to look a thousand times better than the reds. What's up guys, it's your boy Deuce back with another video. Now, this video should be the end of today's videos. You know what I'm saying? This is gonna be the third one for today. We will be installing the smoked out tail lights. Now, if y'all haven't checked out the video where I did the unboxing, go check that video out. I think it was, should've been two videos ago. Not the last one, but the one before that, you feel me? We did the unboxing and I showed y'all the new tail lights we got for the car. So the last video, we went ahead and installed the third brake light. Go check that video out as well. And this video we're gonna be doing the smoked out tail lights. You feel me? They are LED now. I will have to add some more bulbs to them to the reverse lights because the reverse lights didn't come with no LED board or no bulbs or nothing. So I'm gonna add my own LED bulbs to it. You feel me? And we're gonna have some LED third brake. I mean reverse lights. You feel me? And then the brake lights are they should be red LEDs. You feel me? And it's a smoked out like I said tail light. So. Hope y'all enjoyed this video though. I hope y'all like the taillights. Hope y'all like the version 2.0 makeover we're doing for this car. You feel me? So we're basically just redoing this car basically over again. You feel me? Since I got this car in 2017, when I turned 16, 2017, I was born in 2001. Um, I got that car, got this car in 2017. So I really didn't do no customizations really to it. You feel me? Maybe little small things like music and some wheels, but nothing too crazy. But now we finna go crazy. You feel me? We're doing. A whole makeover you feel me we adding side skirts i got a new front bumper because my one on there got the the front license plate and i hate it bro now i hate it then i didn't i didn't did not hate it i back then i liked it you feel me because i'm the one who put it on there but now i hate it bro i wanted it off so bad and we're gonna be getting it off you feel me so i went ahead and got the srt front bumper don't have no srt bad i'm not up badging the car or nothing but i am getting that srt bumper i already ordered it should be coming in with the next couple days um getting the front lip like i said side skirts we doing the tail lights now we did the third brake light we're gonna do a diffuser we're gonna run the exhaust and put a better coder intake with the with the right routing on there you feel me we're gonna redo that and i think that's it i got the little the real roof pieces i gotta get those as well but yeah a lot of money gotta be spent you feel me so i hope y'all like i hope y'all enjoy this stuff man you feel me this little series we finna do of making over this charger you know it's my baby it's my first car I ever bought first car I ever owned my first car just in general with everything you know so it was time i went ahead and did something to this car i've been putting so much effort and time into my box chevy and my cutlass this car deserves it bro so it's a car I drive every day so why not make it look good you feel me we're gonna do um performance later on but for now we're doing cosmetics and looks so Hope y'all enjoyed the video. Make sure I hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Turn that post notification bell to all the way. Y'all be notified every time I drop. Share the channel. Share this video. Let's keep going and elevating together. And I'll catch y'all once we get to the back of the car. All right, y'all. So the plan is I'm going to put one on, on camera. If the video's a little, getting a little bit too long, then the other one I'm going to do off camera. But these tail lights need to be changed anyways. You feel me? They getting sun damaged. They cracking. So if y'all look here. I don't know if y'all can tell. Yeah, y'all see it there. So they are starting to crack. And this one got a hole in it. And I don't know who tried to patch it. Look like somebody tried to put something on there, some residue or something. So yeah, these need to be changed anyways. And like I said, I don't like this full red look on the back of the car. We have done the third brake light, which looks so much better than having it all just red. So we're gonna have the smoked out tail lights now, which are in that box there. So I got them from Amazon. I got the third brake light from eBay. So, like I said, we're going to be doing the tail lights in this video, which shouldn't be too hard. Got my speakers in here, so it might be a little, not spacious, but we got to get this clip off, and we're going to pull this material back. So, like I said, got to get this off, pull the material back, and then, um, yeah, then I should be able to unbolt the tail lights, pull them out, 
But like I said, I gotta get some bulbs so I can test the bulbs out, make sure everything works. I'm gonna have to put some bricks behind and in front of the wheel so the car won't move while I'm trying to test it out. So I know that's not good on the transmission, but I really need to test out the reverse lights to make sure they work. You feel me? So, yeah. Dang, I shouldn't started this. I should have got them bulbs out first and then came back and started it this little segment of the video like i said the tail, smoke tail lights are in there we will be replacing the oem tail lights i'm not giving them away or throwing them away or anything i will be keeping them just in case if i have to throw them back in if those start messing up or something you feel me and i ain't no warranty come on this stuff i think i got 30 days so yeah i'm, I'm gonna keep these just in case like i said if anything go wrong and throw the oems back on for the time being and get some more but oh real quick i want to just show y'all just in case if y'all are new and y'all didn't see the last video or the video before last where we did the unboxing i'm gonna go ahead and show y'all the new smoked out tail lights for the charger so this is the passenger side and this is it you feel me led board here i gotta put the like i said the reverse light in and yeah this is what they look like and i think it's gonna look a thousand times better than the reds it's gonna give it a distinct look give it a different look you know instead of having it all red back here in the back of the car i don't want to crack with nothing but like i said instead of having it all red and like i said with the third brake light was red we decided to go ahead and change this stuff out and this is the beginning of the 2.0 makeover so like i said third brake light is done and out and the new one is in and it's supposed to be smoke i mean it kind of looks smoke now i don't know we'll see once the once the tail lights get on so first thing i need to do is get the bulbs out and then we're gonna test the bulbs because the bulbs ooh, be careful boy the bulbs go in here so first thing i gotta do is get my bulbs out of my car i have some in the car so i'm gonna get those out and then i'm gonna come back to y'all once we start actually taking the tail lights off so stay tuned all right y'all so got my bulbs out i already put one in hopefully they work you feel me if not uh i don't know what i'm gonna do i'm probably gonna take the oem one out even though i don't want to put the yellow one in that's probably what i'm gonna have to do you feel me so we're gonna test that out see if it works i got three more and one of them gonna have to go in the other tail light you feel me the driver side so since actually i'm going to pull the driver side out as well Make sure it ain't damaged. It's not. Everything is good. All right, team. Put that there. Put that back in because the OEM ones will be going in this box and I will be putting them up. So, yeah. First thing, like I said, we got to do. Actually, I'm going to sit y'all. Sit y'all right here. Hopefully, y'all don't overheat quicker. But, yeah. Sit y'all there. So, like I said, I got to get this little clip off. Got y'all sitting on my speaker box. And then we gotta push this back. So we gotta undo this wire. Come on. Come on now. Okay, so it ain't no bolts holding the tail light on. It's just these little tabs. Y'all see it if you can focus. Well, y'all see it, it's good enough anyway. So look like it's just two. I thought it was three this is not something else is holding it on because they're not wiggling off and i can't see nothing and these supposed to fit you know what i'm saying i typed in my car on amazon and these are one that popped up and I really like this smoke look and this LED look so these should they are supposed to work these are supposed to work alright so there's two at the bottom and then one up top so okay here we go I was trying to say, bro. It's supposed to be one more clip. And they pop off. So now I got to undo this wire, which is acting a little, acting a little crazy. 
Like it don't want to come off. Where my flat here go? Let's see my flat here. Oh, I see my fucking screwdriver. Ain't this crazy? Just lose and lose and lose tools, bro. Luckily, I got more than one. Two dudes. There we go. So, luckily, I got more than one. Push that, push that pin so the tail light come off. There we go. Got my tail light um, off, well, plug out, and then the OEM one comes off. Look at that. All right, bring y'all over here and sit y'all up. Come on up. There y'all go. So, OEM one number one is off, and like I said, if I need to, then I will. Um, I will pull the OEM plug out, which is right here, reverse plug. So if I have to, I'll use this bulb, even though I don't want to. The bulb's not shot, everything is still good with it. Even though, like I said, I don't want to, I will if I have to, you know. And then this side marker, even though this one, I guess it got an LED side marker already in there, or LED board, because the side marker plug is here. Reverse plug and then tail lights. So. Yeah, man, let's go ahead and get into putting this new one on. Got the OE one out, like I said. And y'all see, it look like it's missing an eyeball over there. Hold on, y'all, I'm trying to put this to the light from the box. There we go. Got it up in the box. have time to be fighting with it so now we got to put the new one back in or the new one in not back in so let's try and get this in trying to see and then, oh, well, let me show y'all this first so it come with this like gasket type thing you feel me so I can seal it so that's what I'm gonna do. It's like a little square here. Let me bring y'all closer. So if y'all look there, it's a little square. So that's where that little gasket piece gonna go. That's swinging. So let me sit y'all back up again. I'm sorry about keep moving y'all. My camera look like it's finna die. So let me try and hurry this one up so y'all can at least see this side get put on. There you go. Just like it. Oh, this is hard, bro. This is so tough. Oh, look at that, y'all. Look at that, bro. So, aftermarket. Oh, yeah. What y'all think, bro? Which one y'all like better? Let's see if I can. Yeah, one frame. Ooh, bro, them look so tough, bro. I, I just love the way this is looking. If I, I ain't gonna shut it all the way, I'm gonna shut it down gently. Oh, it's a huge gap right there compared to that side. Ooh, huge gap. It'll be all right, though, because the weather's stripping on there. But see, I'm, I'm definitely going to tint that because it don't match that well. But, bro, look at that, bro. That is heat smoked. Oh, man. Yeah, I'm telling y'all, this new look with this car is going to be so fire. And I'm going to have a rear diffuser. I'm not going to lower the car down. I actually want to lift it up. All right probably about like two more inches you feel me so that's that's another thing i actually want to do you feel me is lift the car up a little bit so it don't be so i can actually fit a set of 24s on here i want to put 24s on this car so i definitely want to lift it up a little bit i'm not gonna lower it but bro this is looking really really good bro really really good so now all i, all I gotta do is plug it up i'm gonna test everything you feel me while i'm going and yeah man i hope y'all enjoy you feel me leave y'all opinions like i said i'm gonna have to tint 
that third brake light but it, it kind of match you feel me kind of go with the reverse light housing you feel me kind of match there you know because the, the reverse light housing is a little bit clearer even though the whole thing is smoked out it ain't dark dark smoke but it's smoked and then the third brake light like i said is clear and it kind of matches there so maybe I'll, I'll tint it maybe i'm not you feel me once i get both tail lights on then i can get a better picture but that's what it looks like in one frame new aftermarket o e m old o e m ones so like i said leave y'all opinions which one y'all like better and how y'all like about how y'all feel about my idea and everything i got going so far so let me go ahead and button this up plug it up do the other side i'm gonna let y'all charge for a little bit and then come back to y'all for the outro and show y'all the end result so like i said leave y'all opinions in the comments let me know how y'all feel about it and i'll catch y'all for the end when i'm done I, i'm loving this bro i'm telling you i'm really loving this but let me let y'all charge up and i'll catch y'all for the for the end results and show y'all the outro all right y'all so i am now done and the rear of my car looks so so fire now bro so good so look at it both the tail lights on i had to flip around the um reverse lights because i had them upside down and you really can't tell with them with these leds you don't know which one is the right way so yeah i had to flip it around basically test it while i was doing it but yeah bro look at the look at the <laughs> could really even get my words out because how happy i am I, I love the way this is looking new tail light smoked out new third brake light man it just all looks good and i figured out the gap is supposed to be like that you feel me it's only one way for these to go on and you can't adjust them or nothing it ain't like these older cars you feel me with the headlights you can adjust them and stuff so now that the rear of the car is done we need to go ahead and get the front headlights so that's probably my next purchase i don't know yet i'm trying to figure out how i want to do it if i want to go ahead and do the side skirts then i'm probably gonna do that I, like I, said, I don't know yet but i definitely need to go ahead and get these headlights out and the headlights i'm getting you see these are two pieces the one i'm getting is just one full piece one full headlight you know so i actually want to go ahead and show y'all real quick all everything's working um like i said i've already tested it because i wanted to make sure everything was working before i closed out this video so I'll make sure y'all can see so, actually I'm gonna start the car up so y'all be able to see that and the reverse lights. And then on the next video, we're gonna change out the license plate light to an LED light as well. So, so what's it? y'all seen everything's working everything is good i should have recorded on my phone so i can actually see it for myself because it's gonna be a little minute before i see it in the videos because i'm so ahead but yeah got that all done like i said the third brake light ain't, ain't that off but it is you know so oh. so like i was saying my bad my, my uncle had to tell me something but like i was saying um i haven't really got to see it. i i won't be able to see it on the camera for a little minute because i'm so ahead on videos so i should have recorded on my phone so i can just look at it again but like i said i've already tested everything i know everything works like i said because i had the tail light off and i was looking at it and everything and had the car reverse y'all can see got the bricks literally right there now like i said i know it's not good for the transmission but i needed to to actually see if the lights was working so yep yeah, everything's done now so like i said man y'all leave y'all opinions on how y'all feel about the rear end of my daily now bro i think it looked a thousand times better bro and it was so easy to install it wasn't no i didn't have to use no sockets or nothing literally it was everything was twisted by hand just like in my box chevy on the tail lights it's all them little twist clips by hand and bro it just looked good so maybe i'm not gonna do the third brake like maybe i won't tint it maybe i will I, i'm so indecisive right now but i just think it looks so fire the way it is right now smoked clear smoked but i really just want it all smoked so i'm probably am gonna go ahead and tint it but like I said, i'm indecisive i don't know we gotta get the, the whole car retinted anyway so maybe i have them do the third brake light as well whenever i get the the car tinted so yeah i'm gonna do five percent tint so 
because you as of right now you can kind of see in there you see my steering wheel a little bit so i'm definitely going to redo that probably do five percent but like i said man what y'all think about the the tail lights everything is installed everything is done now i'm gonna go ahead and do the third i mean the license plate light in the next video we're just going all we're doing is changing the bulbs on there so then the whole rear of the car will be led you feel me we're gonna have the white led instead of the yellow that's there we got the brake lights that are bright leds the third brake light which is bright led and i don't i don't think none of this should be illegal you feel me because the lights are still red and then my reverse light is still white so ain't nothing really illegal about this even though on the box it said those are not supposed to be used on street just for like off-roading and stuff but I, I don't see nothing illegal about it you know i don't know you feel me i, I really don't but other than that man catch on the second for the outro leave your opinions in the comments and version 2.0 makeover is is on its way as it's starting it started so yeah man everything is on its way man everything is going as of right now going smoothly you feel me i haven't got no backtrack on my shipping for my bumper everything is going like i said smoothly you know basically creating my own body kit and customizing this car which is something i should have been doing but now i really got the time so I'm, I'm excited bro and just this one step is already making the car look a thousand times better just this one so catch on the second for the outro all right guys so seeing the tail lights like that bro the led tail lights aftermarket tail lights and them smoked it got me already wanting to go ahead and just spend more money and get them headlights in but i don't want to do the headlights just yet until i do like some fitment checks of that bumper you know because I, I need to make sure that bumper everything is good with it and putting the headlights on well to put the headlights on i have to take that bumper off anyways so that's why i want to wait until i make sure that bumper is just right you feel me painting and everything then i will go ahead and get the headlights and then we're going to install the headlights and the bumper together because like i said i can't install the headlights without taking that bumper off so since i already have that bumper off i want to go ahead and do the headlights and that the srt bumper all at once but like i said man 2.0 makeover is is underway bro and it's it's going and it's looking good bro just that little small stuff just the tail lights and the third brake light it already makes this car look a thousand times better bro and we're basically upgrading this car back that's all we're really doing you know and just giving it a makeover like i said i've been customizing my cutlass and my box chevy why not do my daily and give it give it the same love i'm giving my other two cars you know so basically i have three fully customized cars by the time i'm done with everything and i can start i, I, I ain't gonna say that but yeah man leave your opinions in the comments how y'all feel about the tail lights and the third brake light got both of them done hope y'all enjoyed the video though make sure i hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you're new turn that post notification bell to all the way up you know the first time i drop share the channel share these videos keep growing and elevating together i love y'all appreciate y'all keep god first and god bless and i will catch y'all in the next one peace